I'm going to make a quick video from <clears throat> this is for David Aiken. You want to see the results of uh, of uh, sharpening the PCB on the video card. I already made a video about this in the past, so I'll show what it looks like first with the only video card that I have that I didn't sharpie the PCB. I got my test card here. This old, I don't even know what it is. If this is a, I don't know if this, if it's a PCI Express card, that's why I keep it around for testing, but let me see what it is. If this even tells me. Uh, if it's, is that say FX5200? Let me see. It might. I can get it to focus. Yeah, FX fifty two hundred. Um as long as it's PCI Express, I could use this to test stuff. I don't have any uh I don't have any APUs, so there's no video. I know this dumb thing works. So anyway, this whole thing, and then we got the Sharpie treatment, right? So this PCB's thinner than some of the new cards, so it's not going to be as annoying. We'll see how it's like got that like whole. I mean, it's very thin, so it's not that annoying. So, let me take this camera, put it on this mount right here. Okay, so here's my computer. Let me get it, what's it called? Turn on this light. Uh, so you see how, like, you can't really see, this is my video card. You can't really see, um, let me see, you can't really see the PCB because I sharpied it. That's, uh, the line that, go, the line that goes right between the support bracket, this, this thing right down here, this thing down here, and then, uh, there's the back plate on the top, and yeah, it was like this ugly brown line going between that support bracket and between the back plate so I like to sharpie that so yeah I did that on the, the video card for my son too and you want to see what it looked like so here we go um, let me see if I can get better lighting hold on I got this right here I'll turn you on This is everything here is a work in prog progress. It's a mess. <laughs> All right, there we go. So it's kind of like because of the uh, the way the marker is, it's kind of rebounding off, rebounding off of it, and it looks uglier than it than it does look in person. I like got that marker shine, but let's see. Let's just see how it looks without the extra light. But yeah, like that's kind of how it looks. Like you don't see that. You don't see that big brown line over there. It's pronounced. I don't know. So yeah, you see like 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 right here on top of the eight pin. You can see. Can see some of the, the color of that PCB. Man, just I gotta get a new phone. But yeah, I didn't get there because it's hit, it's kind of hidden behind the eight pin. It's not that bad. But uh, I could probably do that too. But yeah, that's all. I mean, I just think it looks better like that. I mean, this ain't no looker. This is just a RX 6600. You know, some scrounger's uh, 1080p card. But hey, man, anything you could do to make it look better. So.
It's like, I'm not going to get extension cables for this build. It's not some super build. This this is good enough. Just got the original uh, MSI 24 pin in there. I'm going to add more RAM to this. These guys will probably be going in there. Give my son 32 gigs of RAM. But, yeah. That's it. That's the difference between these two cards. As far as... PCB, let me see. Put this the same distance as that one. So if you were installed in here... Yeah, like, you could clearly see that line. And you can't see it there. I always hated that gigabyte. Let me see if I can focus this while I've got one hand free. I always hated that gigabyte um, uses that copper color on their heat pipes. A lot of the, the uh, a lot of the other card makers like uh, um, MSI, they, they kind of give it that nickel plating. You know, it's like that almost like a chrome finish. I prefer that than it looking like a penny inside there, but. That's the way they do it, and I got this card for free, so I can't complain too much, so. Yep, that's all. There's a look at how it looks after.